Ticks, chiggers, and spiders are arachnids. When in an area that might be infested, protect yourself by wearing long pants and long sleeves. Insect repellents can also be effective. For more information, refer to the Scouts BSA Handbook. Ticks are small, hard-shelled creatures that bury their heads in the skin. To remove a tick, put on latex-free gloves and use tweezers to grasp the tick close to the skin. It is best to grab the tick as close to its mouth as possible. Gently pull until the tick comes loose. Don't squeeze, twist, or jerk the tick, which can cause the tick's mouth parts to break off in the skin. Wash the wound with soap and water and apply antiseptic. Sterilize the tweezers after use by placing them in rubbing alcohol or boiling water for a few minutes or by holding them over a flame for a few seconds. After dealing with a tick, wash your hands in soap and warm water. Chiggers are almost invisible, but the itching they cause can be intense. These tiny arachnids inject enzymes into the skin and feed on the tissue those enzymes destroy. After a few days, they stop feeding and fall off. The best way to treat chigger bites is to use calamine lotion, hydrocortisone cream, or another non-prescription treatment to relieve the itching. The bites of many spiders cause only minor pain and itching that go away in a fairly short amount of time. However, several kinds of spiders pose a more serious threat to humans. A victim of a spider bite who shows symptoms such as swelling, redness, pain, difficulty swallowing, nausea, vomiting, or muscle pain should be seen by a doctor as soon as possible. Cleanse the bite with soap and water and apply an ice pack to help reduce pain and swelling and treat for shock. In certain areas, stinging insects can be quite common. For further information, refer to the Scouts BSA Handbook. For those who have reactions to fire ants, apply an ice pack and, to reduce swelling, raise the part of your body where you got stung. Taking an antihistamine or applying Benadryl cream is effective. And hydrocortisone cream is good for relieving itching. To treat the stings of bees and wasps, remove the stinger by carefully scraping over the area with the edge of a knife. Applying an ice pack might help reduce pain and swelling. Anyone who begins to experience difficulty breathing after being stung by an insect must be treated immediately for anaphylactic shock. Call 911 or your local emergency number. If the person is carrying a kit for treating anaphylactic shock, follow the instructions found there.